Hey everyone, this is Rob, Northwest Representative with Defenders of Wildlife. I'm here in our Seattle office packing and getting ready to go to Spokane for a few days for our bear spray and bear awareness trainings. For the last two and a half years, Defenders has been going out to the Selkirk Mountains in Northeast Washington to talk to folks living in and around the ecosystem about coexisting with bears. The Selkirks are home to a small and endangered population of grizzly bears, and they're also home to black bears. To reduce the chance of people and bears coming into conflict with each other, Defenders has partnered with the Washington Department of Fish and Wildlife, the Kalispell Tribes Natural Resource Department, and the Washington State University County Extension Office to offer free educational trainings to community groups living in and around the Selkirks about how they can be safe and smart when they're in bear country. These are really great trainings that allow people the opportunity to learn about bears, to learn about how they can recreate safely and responsibly in bear country. And then we also give people the opportunity to practice using bear spray. This is by far and away the best non-lethal tool that you can have with you when you are out in bear country. Whether it's black bear or grizzly bear country, whether you're hiking, backpacking, mountain biking, hunting, you should always have bear spray on you. Because it's so important at the end of these trainings, Defenders donates a can of bear spray to everybody who comes out to the training so that folks have the tools that they need to be safe in the woods and to prevent uh, any conflicts between people and bears. I'm really excited for this uh, upcoming trip because we have some new partners that we're working with. We're gonna be at the REI store in downtown Spokane one day. Uh, and then we're also partnering with some new groups, uh, Backcountry Hunters and Anglers, their Washington State chapter, as well as the Eastern Washington-based Lands Council. Really excited to get out there and talk to folks about bears. So let's get going. Okay, so we made it to Spokane. Uh, that's great. And uh, now I'm gonna go and start getting ready for tonight. We're doing our first bear spray training at the REI, uh, and that is co-hosted with uh, the Lands Council, which is a great nonprofit based here in Spokane. So looking forward to this evening. Okay, we are in the car and headed up north to the Kalispell Reservation for our next uh, bear spray and bear awareness training. Let's go! Look at the bison! So many bison! Okay, so we made it to the Kalispell Reservation and as you can see, uh, those are the Selkirk Mountains right behind me. And we are going over here to the Camas Cultural Center to chat with some folks about bear spray and bear awareness. All right, now we're here at Big Barn Brewery for our training with the Washington chapter of Backcountry Hunters and Anglers. And it's a brewery, so that's fun. Okay, so we just finished up our last bear spray training of this trip. Uh, through this trip, we were able to reach about a hundred different folks and pass out bear spray uh, to those folks and teach them about bear awareness and a lot of the different programs that Defenders of Wildlife has to help people coexist with grizzly bears here in Washington. Mm -hmm. 